Hello friends! In today's video, I'm going to be doing some embroidery on some canvas to make a gift. And yeah, I don't really do a lot of art, but when I do, it's usually pretty fun. And this is just something that I wanted to make, something special, something handmade. And I've seen embroidery on canvas a lot on TikTok. And I was like, you know what? Let's try it. So let's get on with the video. All right, so here I've got the canvas. And I've also got the paint that I'm going to use, just some acrylic paint from the dollar store. And I will also be using this sketch that I did to be the embroidery on top. What I basically want to do is embroider the stencil on the painting and then yeah, that'll be the gift. So just kind of a blue cut straight line embroider of these hands holding on the painting and I'm probably gonna just paint a bit of half and then do kind of like two colors for the embroidery string. I've also got masking tape to make that straight line. First, I'm going to just tape the line across where I'm going to paint my canvas blue. I'm so scared of the paint going through the tape because this isn't painter's tape, it's just regular masking tape, but I just hope it'll work. I just kind of looked at the drawing and marked where I wanted the colors to change and just taped all of that down. I'm gonna have to erase some of the pencil marks on the other side, but hopefully it'll be fine. All right, let's get painting. She's a Mona Lisa. Everyone's lining up to see her. She's a Mona Lisa. Okay, I finished painting the top part now. I might add one more coat once it kind of dries, but I'm gonna paint the sides of the canvas as well. This is really helpful. <laughs> I'm gonna put one more coat just on the front top over here. Time to peel off the tape. Also, I'm so mad. I accidentally got a stain right on the white part and I highly do not like it because it's just like, ugh, I was so close to making it nice. I do have white paint so I could paint over it, but then I don't know how that looked with the canvas, but it's just, it's not really a little dot. It's kind of, yeah, yeah. I might just paint white over it. Oh my gosh, I'm such a dumb, 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 dumb. But anyways, let's rip this paint off. Well, at least it made a pretty straight line. It kind of bled through, but for masking tape, I'm already just thankful it didn't bleed all the way through. I think I'm kind of okay with how it looks right now, but oh, it's just this little spot right here. Oh my goodness, but it's fine. I'm just gonna let this dry. And our next step will be putting the stencil, taping it on the canvas, and then poking holes for the stitches. All right, so now that I finished painting the canvas and it has dried, I made sure to put a few more coats on it just to try to make it seem not so see-through. I am going to start punching in holes with this stencil that I drew. So I'm just basically gonna tape this on about to where I want my embroidery to be. Um, I put some tape on it and then just use the needle that I have here to just poke some holes in the canvas so I'll know where my stitches go. Let's do it. You want to make sure that because the back of the canvas there's that wood frame, you want to make sure that your embroidery doesn't overlap in those spaces because you won't be able to sew there. So I'm just double checking that lining this up so that it doesn't reach the wood sides. Here it's kind of centered how I'd like it to be. And then yeah, all right, I'm going to tape this down.
so this is what it looks like after I've made all the holes and what's next is just to embroider all right so here's the embroidery thread that I'm going to use what I'm going to do is use the white for the parts that are in the blue and use the blue for the parts that are on the white part of the canvas I'm just going to try my best thread it through the needle that I have and then yeah just start embroidering Yay. I'll be honest, I am absolutely terrified as to how this will go, but I'm just hoping that it'll be okay. But yes, I've knotted and threaded my needle, and I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna do a back stitch, which I'm still trying to figure it out in my head what that is, but I think I've got it, and I'm just I'm just gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for it. Just just do it. It's fine. stitching done honestly not mad for my first time i just tried to do a back stitch across that looks a little janky you know what it's fine it's fine i am gonna continue doing these sides and then we'll switch to the blue Alright, I've now finished the top part of the painting and all the white embroidery. So far it looks okay. And next I'm going to be starting the blue embroidery part. Let's go. I'm just about finished and I just kind of want to talk about what I've been doing so basically almost done um, it's honestly pretty fun it's like really calming to like just sew whatever you'd like I think I definitely made a few mistakes I don't know if you really want to see the back of oh god yeah you can definitely see that I've made a few mistakes um, but they're actually not that hard to fix, especially since this is canvas and not specifically actual clothing embroidery, so it's pretty forgiving. But yeah, once you kind of get the hang of things, you just get into the flow of it, and then you're able to just, you know, keep sewing and doing whatever you want. Eventually, it just... you got it. I, I mean, Google helps, definitely. If I accidentally made a wrong stitch or anything, I just put it back through the hole, pulled out the other side, and just kept going, but... So far it looks pretty good. I just have a few more detailing on this side and I'll be done. I think it looks like hands, holding hands. Yes, hopefully. Um, I'm only sad a bit about the blue, not necessarily matching the painted blue. Oh my God, I gotta sneeze. I'm just gonna finish this up and show you the end product.
it's done, it's finished, and I think it looks pretty good. I was just worried about the detailing since I've never embroidered before, but honestly, I, I thought it was gonna go much worse, but I am so happy with this. It was fun. It was fun painting it, embroidering it. Don't look at the back because it looks so disgusting. Um, but yes, finally I am done and I get to present the gift. Thank you guys so much for watching. The person really did like the gift, thank goodness, or at least they told me they did. <laughs> but <laughs> it was honestly really fun to make. Hopefully you guys can also try it too. I don't know if my video is the best to follow or if I did anything wrong, like just go on TikTok or Google. But hopefully you guys do try to make it. It is very fun and I hope you enjoyed the video. Um, so yeah, see you next time. Bye.